Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Marie and I am a beautiful mess. Here I approach makeup from the viewpoint of the novice. So just sit back, relax, and come on a magical makeup journey with me. Today I am really super excited because we are doing a mystery unboxing. I was true to my word and I did end up picking another posh mark box up from Lil Amy G87. I'll put all of her information down below in the description box. I highly, highly, highly recommend if you're looking for a high-end mystery box, Amy is your girl. Go to her. This is my second box. I've seen other boxes by her and just every time it's an incredible experience. Again, you can see that the box is already opened and this is the reason why. If you hear it in my voice, I am still a little bit nasally because I was really super sick this past week and the mystery box came and I was like, I want to make myself feel better. I want to open it, but I wanted my reactions to be real for you guys on camera. So like I did in my previous mystery unboxing, I turned the camera on the products. So you will have to hear my nasally ass voice, but at least you didn't have to see my sick ass in front of the camera doing everything with you guys. So that is why the box is open. Um, if you're into unboxings, stay tuned. If you like what you see, don't forget to hit that like button, the subscribe button, and the notification bell. It lets YouTube know that you like my content and people with the same interests as you will like my content too. So without further ado, let's jump into it. All right, so this is what the package looks like. You've got the fragile, please handle with care sticker here. You've got the literally freezing sticker here. Amy does such a great job with packaging. This is why I keep coming back to her time and again and again and again. All right, so again, this is the $149 box from her. So without further ado, let's get into it. All right, she always does such a great job with packaging. The tape, the amount of tape around this box is just insane. And then when you open it up, there's another padded mailer inside like that to make sure that everything is all good. And then look at this, bubbles and styrofoam in the shape of hearts. Like how, how, how? She just such takes such care and that's why I keep coming back to her again and again and again. So right on the top, we've got her little magnet, right? That is her Poshmark account. So I definitely recommend, all right. Thank you for your purchase. You're incredible. She always puts in an affirmation, which I think is cute. And then this is probably the price list. You got a little sticker on the front here. And then look at that embellishment on the back of the card. Like I can't even. All right, and then this is what the note looks like here. Tis the season. And then it's got a little personalized note here. Thank you so much for your purchase, Marie. Your $149 mystery box is valued at approximately $321. The Grande Lash Serum retail price $36 is a free gift. Love, Amy. So that's gonna be my second lash serum because I got one from a Sephora box, from the Sephora sale. So, I don't know, maybe I should try it, get these puppies bigger and bigger and bigger. Who knows? All right, let's get into the box. All right, and then I also see the price list here, so we'll get into that in a little bit as well. All right, I have moved the box off camera because I want to be surprised as well. So, we're just going to rummage into it. And the first thing I pull out is this. How are you? Really? cute little bag from AOA. Open this up inside. And it looks like we've got some samples from Drunk Elephant. Very nice. 
Ooh, and it looks like we, oh, my first rubber brush. Oh, Amy. Oh, this is the rougher number 15 brush. Oh my God. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Oh, I've always wanted a rubber brush. Oh my gosh. I, this is why I love Amy. Like, she doesn't know me, but she always gets me the stuff I, I want. Oh, and look at Dashing Diva. Amy, do you watch? Do you know? Do you know? I love Dashing Diva. Look, guys, I have a combination on my nails today. It's Christmas. Mm -hmm. But this is the Dashing Diva in Lavender Dreams. I don't have this yet. Very nice. Very, very, very nice. And a cute little bag. Oh, it's exciting. All right, going blindly into the box. What am I gonna pick out next? All right, the packaging that she does, you guys, is just incredible. These little light bulbs, oh, look at a cute little bunny. I love bunnies. I'm a big, huge bunny fan. All right, so we can just push this out. And what do we have here? Oh, I love NARS. I have a couple things by NARS. Now that I'm a little bit more into beauty, uh, I have been getting a little bit more. What do we have here? This is the Pour and Shine Control Primer. So this is the NARS Primer. And this is what the packaging looks like. I have never had the NARS Primer before. I don't have this in my collection, so I'm really excited about that. <gasps> Very cool. I have not heard anybody talk about this primer either, you guys. So I'm excited to try this out. Mm, let's see what else is in the box. All right, we got some cute little snowmen from Amy. Oh, I'm so excited. Her packaging, man. I just I can't even. Oh, we got a little peanut in there. Oh, and there's two things. There's two things. This is the Grande Lash that she was talking about. This is the free gift worth $36. So I'm really excited for this. This looks to be a full size, which I have a trial size already in this. So we'll see if this makes the lashes any longer. I don't know that I need that, but I don't have anybody I can give this to. And then this is the Bobbi Brown Long Wear Cream Shadow Stick. I have a shadow stick from Laura Mercier that I got as a free gift from Sephora. And it looks to be almost the same color as that one that I have. So that's what it looks like. Swatch it on the arm here. Look at the shine on that. Oh, I'm really super excited about that. For those days when I have to go to work and I only have 15 minutes to get ready, this would be really great for that. Awesome, very cool. All right, next up on the list, look at that. Isn't that just so fucking cute? I love her so much. There's two items in here as well. Just the care that she takes. Yeah, I don't do a subscription box. I decided that instead of doing a su subscription box monthly of stuff I really don't want, I was gonna do an, a box from Amy quarterly and that's what we're doing. This is my Christmas box this year. All right, so the first thing that we have in there, <gasps> Dior. I think this is my first Dior, Rouge Dior. This is the Forever Liquid in Forever Dream. Liquid lipstick is what I'm guessing. Look at that. Oh my God, look at that packaging. I can see now why people love Dior. So, oh, look at the doe foot. So that's what the doe foot applicator looks like. Swatch this on my arm. Oh, that is a nice basic bitch color just for me. Loves it. Awesome. So we got that from Dior. And then also in the star packaging, we have one from House. L I've been wanting this. This is the pH hybrid lip oil. I was going to buy this for myself during the Sephora sale and just didn't. <gasps> Amy, how do you always know? How do you always know? Trying not to kill the box. Trying not to kill my nails. <gasps> I was looking at this exact 
one. Oh my God. All right, I have to smell it. Oh, my sniffer may be off, but I think it smells like cherry. All right, as I touch the mirror. So this is one of those pH ones that it's supposed to change with your skin, even if it doesn't, like this color, I love it already. Look at that, look at that shine. I have to put this on my lips right now. I need to know what it feels like. Oh my God. Okay, that's luxurious. Mm. Oh my God, okay, that's my favorite thing so far. That is my favorite thing so far. So from House Labs. This reminds me of my Patrick Ta one, except this one's not plumping. And this one is PH from me, just for me, even though that's all bullshit. <laughs> Excellent, I'm so excited. And it looks like that liquid lip has dried down too, so that's exciting. Got all the sparkles from that Bobbi Brown. <laughs> I am gonna be sparkling like a Twilight vampire, bitch. Love it. See, this is why I like to open this not ahead of time, which is why you have to deal with me sounding like a frog. I like to open this with you guys because then you actually get to hear my reactions. Um, so this is the next package. Why do I see Fenty Beauty in there? Do you guys see that? That's the holiday collection packaging. Oh my God, look at the bubble wrap. I can't even get into this. How do I get into it? Let me get into it off camera. Ooh. All right, it is a little bag that's bubble wrap. I love it. And it is indeed Fenty Beauty. This is the double cheeked up duo. Oh, I'm so excited. I did not get this, but this was something I almost got for myself. Light as air, sweat resistant. Is this cream? It is a cream blush duo. It is the cream blush duo. Let me try to get into it without ravaging my nails. There we go. And I love that it is the pink packaging and not the normal white. And then this is what the blushes look like. Oh my God, that's gonna be stuck. I love dark blush. I, ooh, it feels so creamy. I, I, I do, I love dark blushes. All right, so you've got two shades, Peony Droppa and Maui Booze. So this is Peony Droppa. Look, you can see where the Dior lipstick is still there. It, that's a stain, that's nice. And then Peony Droppa. Put a little bit more on. Look at that, you guys. Oh, I'm a blush whore. You guys know. You guys know. I, mm, mm, mm. Amy, how do you always know what I like? I'm, I'm guessing she doesn't watch, but she always gets me stuff I like, or maybe I would like anything. Who knows? <laughs> Let's see what else we got in the box. All right, guys, there looks to be two more things in the box. This is probably an eyeshadow palette. We're gonna leave this for last, but look, look at the packaging on this, you guys. Even like the washi tape detail, like, I just, I can't get over how she does this. This is just beautiful, Amy. And this is why I will purchase a Poshmark, a Poshmark box from her quarterly instead of buying something monthly that I don't want. This takes a lot of time and effort to get into it, which number one is a pain in the ass, but two, I greatly appreciate because I've never had anything uh, damaged from Amy. So like that's the first layer of bubble wrap right there. And then there's a second one, just like the other one. I've never had anything come damaged from Amy ever, which is why I will continue to purchase from her. All right, what do we have here, guys? <gasps> oh my God, more Dior. Well, we got two eyeshadow palettes, look at that. So this is one of their five color eyeshadow, high color eyeshadow wardrobes, long wearing creamy powder palette. 
And this one is in 669 Soft Cashmere. Let's open her up and see. Look how luxurious this is. This is why Dior is so fucking expensive. These are my first two ever Dior products. Last time we had something from Gucci with a Gucci lipstick. But this is my first ever Dior's. I'm so happy. <gasps> oh, that's stunning, you guys. But yeah, it's basic bitch. But with what Amy does, like, she kind of has to because you kind of have to appeal to the masses. And basic bitch is what everybody... Oh, look, it's a tray that comes out. <gasps> wow. All right. And then there's a mirror that comes with it. But let's swatch this, shall we? Oh my god, they're so creamy and buttery. That matte, oh my god. All right. Last box, we got our first Charlotte Tilbury ever. And I don't use that palette often, but when I do, it is such a pleasure it is effortless. I don't have to think about it. It feels luxurious. Look at these, you guys. <gasps> oh, that's a topper shade right there. And then let's go in with the thumb just because I'm lazy because I'm sick. And do the middle one right there. That is definitely a basic bitch palette, but I love it. I absolutely fucking love it. And I can't wait to put that on my eyes. And we're going to have to do a video of trying on stuff that we got from Amy. Mm, I'm so excited. All right, guys. Now the piece of the resistance is this guy right here. The last box we got from Amy, we got the Anastasia Beverly Hills Nouveau palette, which was brand new at the time because I ordered it when I first started my YouTube channel in the summer. And it had only been a couple months old that I was so excited for. And I use that palette all the time for everyday looks, for going out looks. So let's see what this one is. Oh, wait, I'm so excited. All right, we're going to take the scissors. I don't think it's an Anastasia palette. And then we're going to go this way. It's gold. Oh! <gasps> Oh my god! I'm sorry if I just screamed in your ear. Oh my god, Amy, how do you fucking know? Always. I was gonna buy this. I was going to fucking buy this for myself. <gasps> Holy shit. This is the Huda Beauty Empowered Palette. I was. I was hemming and hawing about this during the Sephora sale. I was gonna pull the trigger on it, and I didn't. And now I'm really glad I didn't because now we have it. I, I always want to say for free, but it's not. It's on a discounted price. Like when you buy from Amy, you pay $150 for the box. Look at those. I don't want to get the mirror in there, but look at those. Oh, there's going to be a video coming soon for that. I'm not going to take the time to swatch that right now. But, oh my God, that's gorgeous. And I've been, I've been wanting this. I had been wanting this. And I, I said, no, Marie, you're, you don't need it. You're not going to buy it. It's too much money. You've bought a whole bunch of other crap. Don't do it. And, you know, I did. I spent $150 on the box from Amy. And we'll pull the price list out and we'll take a look at that. So I feel like I get that at a discounted price because I got everything for $150 when it's a $321 value. How she does it, I'll never know, but I'm thankful for it. And that's why I will continue to order from her quarterly instead of doing like a boxy charm or the Allure box because you're not going to get this in one of those. Nope. All right. So this is everything that we got from Amy in the box i'm so excited and then this is the price list i love her little stickers she's amazing and i did leave a review for her she is incredible incredible all right so retail pricing of everything in our box so this is what the price list looks like i just wanted to show it to you guys 
So basically anything that's highlighted is brand new and I'll denote that, but I just wanted you to see it really quick. So the Rouge Dior Forever Liquid Forever Dream, that's a lipstick, $42 for that lipstick. I would never have paid $42 for that. The House Labs PH Lip Oil, brand new, $24, love that. The NARS Pour and Shine Control Primer, $36 for that bitch. Yeah, I would never pay for that. The Bobbi Brown, which is brand new, Long Wear Cream Eyeshadow in Moonstone, that's $32. The Huda Beauty Empowered Eyeshadow Palette, which of course is brand new, just came out recently, that is $67. The Dior Five Pan Palette, $62. This is almost as expensive as the Huda Beauty Palette. That's in fucking sane to me. Um, the Fenty Double Cheeked Up, that was $34. And then the Ruffer Brush is $24. There's no price on this, so that just must have been thrown in as a gift along with the bag. So the grand total of everything in the box is $321. I mean, that's crazy to me. And this is why I will continue to buy boxes from E. The last time we bought a box, it was a $125 box, and I was not unhappy with that box either. This was the $149 box, and I'm very excited for this box. Definitely, definitely, definitely recommend her. Again, all of her information is going to be in the description box down below. So if you are looking for a gift for the holidays and you don't know what to give someone, that is a makeup lover in, in your life, I definitely recommend. She has boxes that range from like $100 all the way up to $300. And like I said, I've gotten a $125 box and $149 box, and I have been happy both times, and I will continue to purchase from Amy. So yeah, all of her information is going to be in the description box down below. She is on Poshmark. She posts boxes up on Wednesdays and Saturdays. All right, so that was the mystery box from Amy. I am super excited that I got the Huda Beauty Empowered Palette. That's like my favorite thing inside of the box. And I can't wait to play with that and make a video for you guys on it. I'm, I can't wait. I just can't wait. It's happening. It's going to happen. Hopefully by the end of the year it'll happen. But thank you guys so much for spending time with me. If you ever picked up a box from Amy, what did you get in your box? How has your experience been? Everybody that I've heard from, it's been nothing but stellar. And her boxes sell out like crazy. You've got to stock her upload times in order to get something. And like I said, this is my second one. Instead of buying like a BoxyCharm subscription for products that I will never fucking use, I will continue to quarterly spend my money that I would have spent on that and pick up one of these boxes instead for you guys. And for me too, because you know, it's a present for myself and you. <laughs> All right guys, thank you so much for spending time with me and we'll see you in the next video. Bye everybody.